Happy Monday, everybody. This is your market update for July 17th. And uh, the stock market initially started off the day slightly mixed, um, continued to focus on corporate earnings, which has been strong for the most part, especially in the banking sector and in healthcare. Um, Dow actually closed up 76 points today, which was at its highest level in 2023. So that's great. NASDAQ closed up 131 points and S&P 500 closed up 17 points. Uh, Mortgage-backed securities carrying over some negative momentum from Friday afternoon initially opened today down two basis points and at one point in time was down almost 20 basis points but did rally back this afternoon and uh, currently uh, market still open with about 30 minutes left to go but uh, is up 11 basis points. Um, continuing to run into some overhead resistance uh, but continuing to trade in a, in a, a very tight range sideways so um, hopefully with some good news this week, we can break through that level of resistance and uh, see some further improvement in mortgage rates. Um, with that being said, uh, news this week that uh, we need to keep an eye on tomorrow. We've got retail sales figures coming out as well as the National Association of Home Builders um, home index value um, and then industrial produ production and capacity utilization report. Wednesday, we've got mortgage application data as well as housing starts and a 20 year bond auction that afternoon. And then Thursday, we've got initial jobless claims from last week, which measures unemployment claims filed for the first time, as well as continuing claims and also existing home sales. So definitely some stuff on the radar this week that could move the needle a little bit. We'll keep an eye on that. I hope that you all have a great afternoon and I'll see you tomorrow.